Wilms tumor, or nephroblastoma, is one of the most commonly occurring tumors of the abdomen in children and the most common kidney tumor. The peak age for diagnosis is at three years old, with boys more often affected than girls. It is more common among siblings and twins, suggesting a possible genetic connection, although no genetic marker has been identified at this time. Wilms tumor is rare after the age of eight years. The exact cause of the tumor formation is unknown, but Wilms tumor is often associated with other birth defects. While the tumor may become very large, it usually remains encapsulated. However, a rapidly growing tumor can obstruct the inferior vena cava or the intestines and can metastasize via blood or lymph vessels to the lungs. A child with Wilms tumor may look healthy and play normally. The first sign is usually the appearance of a large lump in the abdomen, often noted by parents while bathing or dressing the child. As the tumor grows, the child may develop stomach pain, fever, blood in the urine, or high blood pressure. Other signs and symptoms include abdominal hernia or mass, anorexia, nausea, vomiting, general discomfort or malaise, hypertension, constipation, and hemihypertrophy. Sometimes the only symptom is urinary tract infection. For diagnosis, special emphasis is placed on a complete medical history and physical exam, checking for risk factors and symptoms such as a family history of cancer or the presence of the associated birth defects in the child. The physical examination reveals an abdominal mass. High blood pressure may also be detected. Ultrasound, CT, MRI, angiography, chest x-ray, and bone scan can also help diagnose the tumor and any metastasis. Clinical staging of the tumor is done to determine the extent of the tumor and to identify the most effective treatment plans. Surgical exploration provides tissue for diagnosis and staging as well as tumor removal. Radiation therapy and chemotherapy will often be started after surgery, depending on the stage of the tumor. Chemotherapeutic agents used for Wilms tumor include dactinomycin for stage 1 tumors and a combination of vincristine and doxorubicin for more advanced stages. With early diagnosis and prompt treatment, the cure rate is high. What are the complications associated with Wilms tumor? Spread of the tumor to the lungs, liver, bone, or brain. This is the most severe complication. High blood pressure and kidney damage can occur as a result of the tumor or treatment. Preoperatively, you'd avoid palpating the child's abdomen to prevent seeding or spread of the tumor. Assess vital signs and observe for signs of complications. Provide age-appropriate explanations, encourage expressions of fear and concerns, and provide information to prepare the child and family for surgery and treatment. Postoperatively, You'd monitor and alleviate the child's pain, check vital signs and intake and output. You'd support GI function, maintain patency of the NG tube, monitor bowel sounds, monitor for signs and symptoms of obstruction from vincristine induced ileus, and check for signs and adhesion formation. You'd infuse IV fluids, monitor lab values for electrolyte imbalances and metabolic alkalosis, monitor and support respiratory function, perform pulmonary toilet and change the child's position every two hours, observe the incision site, change the dressing as ordered, provide meticulous oral care, provide skinned wound and central line care, maintain reverse isolation if white blood cells decrease to protect from infection, administer chemotherapy and radiation as prescribed and monitor the side effects of treatment, promote adequate nutritional and fluid intake, and provide developmentally appropriate stimulation. Parent and child teaching includes how to dress the child appropriately for weather changes, how to monitor for side effects of radiotherapy and chemotherapy, how to care for the skin, wound and central line, nutrition counseling, how to cope with the illness and altered body image, and follow-up planning and scheduling of appointments.